Hi, I'm Reed McLean. I'm the personal training manager at River Point Sports and Wellness. I'm here with Jeremy. We're going to be demonstrating how to do a leg lift properly and improperly. When doing a leg lift, you want to focus on how you're engaging your core. Here, Jeremy is demonstrating how to improperly do a leg lift. You will notice that his lower back has a big arch to it, which is creating instability in his lower abs, which is where we're working on creating stability. When you're doing your exercise with your leg raise, you want to make sure that your legs are straight, your core is engaged, and your legs straight up to 90 degrees, back down slow and controlled. The main thing you want to focus on is keeping your abs fully engaged with your lower back pressed down to the ground. With a leg raise, there's a few ways that you can do it to make it harder or easier. Okay? A more advanced way to be doing it is with hands out to the side. Okay? So with hands out to the side, you're really fully engaged in your core, creating the movement through your abs. Next way you can do this to modify is putting your hands underneath your hips. By sitting on your hands, it supports the lower back. It doesn't force you to have complete control through the abs if you're a little weaker in the lower ab area. One final way to make a modification to this is by bending the knees. Okay? By keeping the knees bent, pulling the knees straight to the chest, it further reduces the strain on your lower back and reduces the amount that you're controlling from your lower abs, but still working through your lower abs.